Hi and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing an art channel page where I used one of my altered tea bags. I'm using white acrylic paint and spread it all over my page. I'm sprinkling some brush powder onto the wet paint. Now I'm closing the pages and we'll see what happens. I decided that I want to have more coverage of the surface so I add some more white paint. As I'm still not happy, I use a small brayer to go over the paint. I don't do it too much because I don't want to create mud. When this is dry, I go in with white gesso and my palette knife. Now I have two backgrounds and I am working on the left side. I am adding some molding paste with a stencil from Stamplerations. After the paste is dry, I am adhering some wildflowers cut with a Sizzix style designed by Tim Holtz from an old book page. I use matte medium to apply it. I use a drawing pen to redraw the contours of the wildflowers. I'm going in with some brush or spray paints, but I'm applying them with a brush instead of spraying them onto my page.
I picked out one of my altar tea bags and also an old book page. I will link you up to the video where I create this tea bag in the top right corner. Before I adhere it to the page, I add some white and black color splatters. I cut my title with dice from Tim Holtz and I cut it from black cardstock that was covered on one side with double sided tape. So it's really easy to stick the letters down. To bring everything together, I paint some black acrylic paint into the corners and I scribble some journaling into the wet paint. Here is the finished page. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. See you soon. Bye!